to my channel. I'm Zena, Warthog Princess, and we got Vera mail today. If you get these catalogs with your packages, be sure to look at them because right here it says there's a coupon and the code is right here on the back. And it's 20 off of 75 or more in stores and online. So more Vera. Before I went to softball game today, go cats. Um, I got some beer mail, so I got a new Zip ID. This one is the Chambray Garden, the new VBU collection. And the other is the Shore thing, but it's the one with the turtle on it. So, pretty excited to use those. Also got the swimsuit wristlet, which is a nice size, and it's waterproof inside. So off I went to the game, happy to have Vera in hand, and guess what was waiting for me when I got home? Vera mail! So we're gonna do another unboxing, here goes. First item. Let's see. Luggage tags. Got these, I always put these on my backpack, so guess what else is gonna be in one of these boxes? couple of backpacks to put these on. So those are cool. Let's see what's in the next one. It's like Christmas. I love opening packages. All right. Woo. Speaking of backpacks, this one, ooh, and another catalog. But no code on the back. Hmm, okay. Anyway, so, this is the Lighten Up Grand, but it looks like there's some new features. They've recently changed the front pocket construct. And there's a secret pocket on the side now. Whoop, whoop. Oh, that's deep. Goes all the way across. You've got the regular laptop area, padded both sides. It's interesting that's such a light gray though, and not a pattern, but oh, whatever. Let's see, there is a keep charge pocket in this one or slip for whatever you want. Although, maybe it's not a keep charge pocket because there's no grommet to go into the next pouch. But you know why I'm retarded? Okay, this is a journey backpack, not the other one. So that explains a lot, okay. So inside the first pouch, we have this little key thing. I think that's nice. We also have two slip pockets and two pen pouch. There also, on this side, there's a nice zip pocket with the mesh, whatever. Cool. So that's the front main pouch. And then, of course, you have sunglass thing on top. And big main pocket, you've got two mesh slips, and then on the bottom, you have the shoe compartment or whatever else you want to put down there. Um, the more you stuff this part though, the more you lose out on the inside here, because as you can see, that pooches up into the main compartment. So. It's a trade-off, but still great to have more organization um, pouches. You do also have, on this version, because it is the biggest backpack, you have the chest strap, and you have a trolley sleeve as well. So, pretty cool. Oh, and I don't know if you know this, I guess where you can tuck in your straps, there's a big slip in the back. Okay, cool. Sorry for misspeaking about that. I should have... Paid a little closer attention. All right, this is the new, what is this called? Cell phone crossbody, Carson cell phone crossbody. I only got one. This is the pretty posies. So I thought, well, that's great. Um, the zip IDs fit in the pocket here, so I've seen. Oh, I thought I had one in my pocket, but anyway. So it's a little crossbody for your phone. All right. Alright, here's the next one. Let's see what we got. 
My puppy ran away because she doesn't like boxes. I don't know why. Okay. Okie dokie. The standard little paper sheets. got the Lighten Up Cosmetic, Medium Cosmetic, in the Kaleidoscope Rosettes. The Hadley Backpack in Pretty Posies. Oh, this is the um, Clear Plastic Lotion Bag, I think it's called. Let's see. A lot of wrapping on the plastic stuff. Okay. So, officially titled Clear Lotion Bag in Classic Navy. I got this to go with my Shore Thing and also Spring Tide Navy stuff for the beach. Anyway, great stuff. All right. Pretty box, too. Okay, next, the last box, let's see. I'll open it up here again. They put the shipping label right across the seam. This must be from Wisconsin, I'm guessing. Thanks. Ooh. Another coupon. Coupon. All right. Thank you for always thinking of Mayfair for all your Vera needs. We appreciate you. Yay. Thank you for being such great customer service people. Um, all right. Large cosmetic and sure thing. These are nice. I, I really don't have any of these until now in the large. It's nice pretty inside with the clear plastic. I am very happy to see the interior linings in cotton coming back. Um, very, very good. So thanks Vera for listening. The front pocket is not plasticized, but it's good size and it is cotton and it has both the interior pattern and just the regular exterior. So nice there. Let's see. The stainless steel travel mug in Vines Floral. This was actually on sale. Um, so pretty excited to try these out. I haven't tried them. I've seen mixed reviews, but it's just a pops in and then it slide opens like clothes. But purple is my favorite color. So I thought if I'm going to try one, it might as well be purple and on sale. All right. Oh, that's my receipt. Here's the other large cosmetic. This one's in the Pretty Posies. I really have taken a liking to this pattern. I'm not so big on grays normally, but the colors are just nice and, and vibrant. And I love that. I love that a lot. So inside pattern. By the way, if you're not aware, it's the uh, breast cancer pattern this year. They've raised over 30 million to support critical advancements in breast cancer research. That's pretty amazing. All right, so this interior is nice. And same as the other, it's the cotton with the clear plastic. Although it's not attached in the bottom again. So kind of like the Diddy thing, it just kind of free, not totally free. I don't know, we'll see. But I have lots of large cosmetics, but not the new iconic. So we'll see how we go in those. Now we're getting to the backpacks that I was talking about before. Sorry about that. Um, these are the Lighten Up Grand Backpack in Kaleidoscope Rosettes and Pretty Posies. Again, I, you know, I like pink, but I've never been a big pink person, but this pattern for whatever reason has struck me. Um, interestingly enough, when you look at the patterns right now, 
the kaleidoscope versus the kaleidoscope rosettes. They're both geometric, vibrant pink patterns with flowers, but the lighten up versions these days have been coming out with a more like wider dispersion. So let me show you what I mean with the pretty posies and what's it called? Toss posies, pretty posies and toss posies. I'll show you the difference what I'm talking about. So here's the pretty posies, you can see it's beautiful pattern, but they're kind of close together. And then when you look at the toss posies, it's farther apart. Now, anybody who knows Vera, you've seen this happening. Sometimes though, I do like like the lighten up pattern better, but the object I'm looking for, I'd prefer in cotton. So I kind of miss when you could get both, you know what I mean, or the crossover. Sometimes I want the cotton pattern in a lighten up object. Sometimes I like the lighten up pattern in a cotton object. Um, but what else I will say about these two patterns right here is if you're not aware, the new Disney patterns that just came out yesterday, they supposedly coordinate very nicely with these. So I'm really excited to see and hopeful that that works out to be as advertised because I ordered a bunch of stuff yesterday too. So we'll do a Disney video later, but for today, this concludes the unboxing. See you again soon.